Every year, more than 500 billion bottles of water are consumed worldwide. Have you ever wondered about the journey a drop of water takes to become a bottle of pure water on the supermarket shelf? Let's explore the process of bottled water production, a process far more complex than you might imagine. Subscribe now and join Captain Discovery's journey! Bottled water has become an indispensable part of our lives. But did you know that its journey began as far back as the 1600s, when people used containers made of reeds and clay to store and transport water? By the 18th century, the English started bottling water for mineral springs for sale. And in the 1780s, Johann Jacob Schwepp revolutionized the industry by adding carbonation to water and selling carbonated water in Geneva, Switzerland. In the 19th century, outbreaks of cholera and typhoid fever drove the demand for bottled water and the introduction of chlorination in the 1890s helped prevent the spread of waterborne diseases. In the early 20th century, chlorine became widely used in water treatment, and bottled water increasingly gained popularity as a safer choice, especially amid rapid urbanization. By 1941, one of the first standards for bottled water was established in the U.S., enhancing the quality and safety of this product. The introduction of PET plastic bottles in 1973 ushered in a new era for the bottled water industry, making the product more accessible and affordable through mass production. Since the 2000s, advertising has increasingly focused on promoting bottled water as a safer alternative to tap water, even though this is not always the case. This led to a boom in bottled water consumption, which significantly increased the use of plastic bottles. In 2011, the U.S. Environmental Protection Agency, EPA, acknowledged that plastic pollution was becoming a serious issue, with the weight of plastic used per bottled water unit continuing to rise. By 2016, a turning point occurred with the widespread introduction of reusable and recyclable water bottles, marking an important effort to reduce reliance on single-use plastic bottles and address the global plastic pollution crisis. Now, let's dive into the bottled water production process. Have you ever wondered where the water in a bottle comes from? Is it truly as clean and safe as we believe? Everything starts with selecting the water source. It could be spring water, deep underground aquifers, or even treated tap water. But before the water is introduced into the production process, it must undergo rigorous quality checks. The water must meet stringent standards for purity, mineral content, and must be free from any impurities or harmful microorganisms. This is the first and one of the most critical steps to ensure that the bottled water you consume is genuinely safe.
So, after being selected, where does the water go? Does it become as pure as possible? The water is passed through a filtration and purification system, involving several stages such as mechanical filtration to remove dust particles, demineralization to eliminate unnecessary substances, and finally, disinfection using UV light or ozone. This is when the water is transformed into its purest form, ready to be bottled. Discovery Challenge How much bacteria do you think this process can eliminate? A. 50% B. 99% C. 100% Leave your answer in the comments below and see if you guessed right. How is the water packaged and sealed without being contaminated by the external environment? Do you think about this every time you open a bottle of water? The process begins with the creation of the bottles themselves. In modern factories, polyethylene terephthalate plastic is melted and then blown into molds to form bottles. These bottles are lightweight, durable, and designed to preserve the purity of the water. Next, the caps are produced in a similar manner, where plastic is molded into the precise shape required to securely seal the bottles. Once the bottles and caps are ready, they are thoroughly cleaned and sterilized to remove any potential contaminants. In a sterile environment, the water is then filled into the bottles. This is done with high-speed automated machinery, capable of filling up to 36,000 bottles per hour, ensuring that each bottle is filled precisely. Immediately after filling, the bottles are swiftly capped to prevent any chance of contamination. This entire process is carried out with incredible precision and efficiency, ensuring that the water remains pure from start to finish. Watching thousands of bottles of water move along the production line, you'll be amazed at the precision and efficiency of today's technology. Then, each bottle is labeled with complete information, such as the production date, expiration date, and the source of the water. We can feel reassured knowing that each bottle of water goes through a strict control process to ensure its quality. Before you can buy this bottle of water at the store, how many quality checks do you think it has undergone? Before leaving the factory, each batch of products undergoes a final quality check to ensure that there are no errors. Only when they meet the standards are the bottled water shipped to stores, supermarkets, and retail outlets nationwide. And when you open a bottle of water, remember that it has undergone a long and meticulous journey to reach your hands.
We are facing a significant challenge each year. Around 8 million tons of plastic waste enter the oceans, much of it coming from the bottles of water we use every day. According to statistics, only about 9% of plastic waste is recycled, and plastic bottles are one of the major contributors to this problem. However, the bottled water industry is striving to change this reality. Many companies have switched to using recycled plastic for their bottles and have developed plastic collection and recycling programs. Moreover, with the growing awareness of environmental protection, we have seen the emergence of eco-friendly bottled water products, such as bottles made from bioplastics or even reusable bottles. But the real solution lies with us, the consumers. Choosing eco-friendly products and recycling water bottles after use can make a big difference. Thank you for joining us in exploring the production process of bottled water. If you're amazed by the blend of technology and craftsmanship we showcased, like, share, and comment your thoughts below.